The sound of needles poking through pieces of clothing welcomes you to the Kitui County Textile Center. Constructed April last year and formally launched in October, all at a cost of 168 million shillings. We we'll be making profit but we have not broken even. I believe by April of next year, which will now be about one year, it, we will be able to break even. Hide at work are over 350 young girls and boys and fewer older ones as they put together various garments. Governor Charity Ngelo says her focus at first was school uniforms for the over 400 schools in the area. But then the national government contracted the textile center to stitch 7,200 uniforms for chiefs and their assistants. We can manage uh, 3,600 pieces. Uh, school uniforms, uh, chief's uniform. We are able now to produce uh, 480 pieces a day, both ceremonial and uh, regular uniforms. The joy of this Secretary County Textile Centre, which we call Kikotech, is to see this number of young people who are now working here today, that they can feed their own families. 22-year-old Emmanuel Mwema is a supervisor. He's one of the pioneer staff and says Kikotech has not only provided jobs, it has transformed the community in Siongela where it is located. The embroidery section fitted with state-of-the-art machines is able to produce 24 garments within 15 minutes. Once the required pattern is fed into the digitized machine, it programs the other components and sewing begins. In the end, is the finished product. We are lacking in ourselves and the leadership. But noble as the initiative is, it has been hard hit by politics, the strained relations between the county executive and the county assembly and also some of the elected leaders has resulted in a delay in the passing of the necessary law to make the factory legal. The county government seeks to disengage the textile factory from the county and have it run as a cooperative. These as many express hope that the opening of these and other textile factories in the country will lead to the revival of gin rays and cotton farming as another cash crop. Chamutai Goen, Citizen TV, Nairobi.